I'm on a very bright Trinidad and Tobago stand at World Travel Market, and I'm with uh, Dr. The Honourable Rupert Griffith, Minister of Tourism, New Minister of Tourism, and with Mr. Ernest uh, Littles, who is the President of the Trinidad and Tobago Development Corporation. Gentlemen, good afternoon to both of you, and thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to meet with me this afternoon. Good first afternoon question. Good afternoon, and thank you for inviting us for this interview. Pleasure. Uh, Dr. Griffith, first question to you. What are the unique attributes of Trinidad and Tobago as a tourism destination, as compared to maybe other islands in the Caribbean? Well, Trinidad and Tobago is a twin island republic. Each island has its unique um, tourism niche. For instance, uh, Tobago is about leisure and ecotourism. Trinidad is more um, business and some leisure and culture. The marriage between Trinidad and Tobago gives you a good fit and a great mix. And the country's beauty, that is its people, its flora and fauna, um, and the kinds of cuisine we have, which is unique around the world. And I think the biggest asset is the people itself, the friendliness and the welcoming attitude. We believe Trinidad and Tobago is a unique destination for the for tourists. It's undeniable that tourism worldwide over the last 18 months has, has suffered a, a bit of a dip. How is the outlook looking for Trinidad and Tobago in 2011 going forward? Well, it looks excellent to us. We have seen some growth in Trinidad and Tobago and we are putting measures in place which will enhance that growth. There is a number of new products that we are putting in place. Um, we've done our survey, we've done, we, we, we know what the people want to see and we are putting measures in place to satisfy that need. What we want to do is to allow both local and international visitors to the, to the various um, destinations. Uh, we are developing a number of new destinations and we want our people and also our international visitors to be happy, receive value for the money and when they leave they will tell a friend, a family, a relative Trinidad is the destination to go for great quality and great service and just a great time in the you've Trinidad got a, style. You've got a, a big stand and I know there's a number of uh, important co-exhibitors with you. Would you like to talk about some of those who have come over to London this year? Well. We have a delegation here of about 54 people from both islands, Trinidad and Tobago. 64 people, that's a figure. 64 from Trinidad and Tobago. And they, they represent all of the stakeholder organizations, the tour guides, the, um, the hoteliers, the, um, the, the ground travel guys, the small property owners, and um, just a host of them. And they are here. and. Today being midway of the of the um, the, the WTM, we are we are already I think we could say it has been a success for us in terms of the response that we have gotten at this time. So and we are very pleased about that. Well, that, that that's very very encouraging. And what can visitors, uh, trade delegates coming to the Trinidad and Tobago stand uh, expect? What 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 are they going to find on the stand? Well, they are going to find um, a large number of welcoming. Um, stakeholders, I would mm -hmm. like to call them, that is people with the various interest areas, um, welcoming them to come to Trinidad and Tobago, um, providing them with the basic information they would need, giving them certain assurances, certain guarantees such as being safe, being happy, and the willingness to serve them when they come to Trinidad and Tobago. So we have all of the, the um, brochures, we have CDs, we have our people, as you look around, you will see some of our carnival exhibits, mm -hmm. you will see some of our mass players here, and um, they will also see Trinidad and Tobago from the air. I don't know if you've been upstairs, but they have a, a, a module of uh, air, air flight coming into Trinidad and Tobago, so you get a chance to see it from the air, mm -hmm. then you land, and then you see the people. And it, it gives you a present like you are in Trinidad and Tobago. Wonderful. And wonderful. that has been very successful. We have had a beeline of people going in there to experience that as well. Well, clearly the UK is one of your most in, important markets, which uh, signified by the very large presence here. If you had one uh, message, Dr. Griffith, to the trade, 
uh, who are coming to world travel market to leave WCM about, about Trinidad and Tobago, what would that be? I would say come to Trinidad and Tobago is the best destination you can choose. And I'm not saying that jokingly, we mean it. We mean to serve. We have prepared our people to service. And we are more than, they, they can come in welcoming arms to our country that mm -hmm. gives them a variety of flora and fauna, greatest cuisine, tremendous sights and uh, uh, the greatest carnival in the world. If you like ecotourism, we have one of the second largest nesting for the leatherback turtles. Um, that is from about March to the end of August every year. And we have a host of cultural activities year round. We have a very diverse population mm -hmm. the, between majority Indians, Africans, then you have um, um, Europeans and Chinese. just Chinese, well, that's part of Asia, we think. But <laughs> all, all the peoples, and it's a mix of culture, all very friendly, willing to serve, and you can learn something from them. In our Chinese culture, we have a number of programs we put on. We have the Dragon Race, we have the Dragon Dance, we have the, um, what's the last one we did there? The, um, that was the, 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 that's the one with the lighting. The lighting, sorry about that, the stumble. But there's so much, um, I can't begin to, to tell you how much we have in the Chinese culture, the Indian culture, we have Diwali and um, Katik and a whole host of things, and in the African culture. The well, you've done, you've done a very good job of, uh, of making Trinidad and Tobago sound more attractive than ever. Thanks for taking time out, Dr. Griffith. Thank you very much indeed. Sure. But before Pleasure. you close, I'd like to extend a welcome to you to oh, come visit us much. in Trinidad and Tobago. I recommend pleasure. strongly the cuisine and the carnival. Your, I've, your, I've, your, your I've senses will carnival. never be the same after you experience carnival and <laughs> Trinidad and Tobago sure. cuisine. Sure. So I extend a, a welcome to you to come uh, to visit That's us. a very generous. You're welcome. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Cheers.